good afternoon i thought i'd just quickly my timu order has just arrived so i've just literally tipped it out of the packet and bought it upstairs <laughs> um I, I don't know what the prices are i'll have to put them on screen for you because um yeah i literally opened the packet and went for it um yeah i picked up a um quarter inch yes quarter inch uh, the left foot for my sewing machine because I've got one where it clips on it's a low shank I think they call them so I'm going to give that a go it looks a lot thinner than the one I've got at the moment so I'm hoping that'll be good um, I picked up these because my daughter wants me to start making some dog cards so it's like get well soon and doggies especially with a sausage <laughs> sausage dog um yeah so i just picked up those as i say i will put the prices on the screen because i can't remember the price of anything now now these i didn't order these <laughs> I, I don't even know what they are let me just shove that there um did i i might have done <laughs> i can't remember oh um anyway they are fish by the looks of it I can't think that I ordered fish, I'll be honest with you. Uh, yeah, I don't think I ordered these. Um, I'll check. Oh, it might have been the, for the butterflies that I ordered them. I didn't realise it was mixed genre. The one thing I would say, when you um, buy something from this company, check what size everything is because... Some of this stuff has arrived, like stencils for my gel plate, and they're tiny. <laughs> I think I kind of knew these ones were, because I I think I picked up a load of C6 ones. Um, uh, well, yeah, C6, A6. Um, let me get a piece of black card, and I can show you. Oh, I just got back from doing a load of dog walking. Whew shattered so yeah my my thinking with these is i just lay loads on my big gel plate and then i pick up and they're not terribly well cut there oh, that's okay oh it's a bit broken there they're all right i think they weren't expensive again i'll have to put the prices on the screen because i can't remember how much everything was now like those i think these are going to look really good quickly whip through them if I can leaves um I built this with my own money I'm not sponsored I know there's a lot of people are being sponsored by them to do reviews and stuff so this is my honest opinion I haven't opened this one so yeah I got the sort of mixed sets I want to get myself a 6x6 gel plate, but I can't afford it at the minute. So, because although the big ones are nice, sometimes you don't want to do a big thing. Triangles. Yeah, these are going to be fun. I've got fun playing with these. Oh, there's two there. Squirrels. Crosses. That's nice. I like that one. And squares. And then I... Oh, there's another one there. Flowers. and then i ordered these slightly bigger ones i'll leave them in the packet it's not too shiny um again i think side by side there's the other one i think side by side they'll fit on my eight by ten and fill it if you like so yeah i think they're gonna be all right i'm gonna play with them and we'll we'll see what's what with those um yeah i'm got to check on them i don't Unless it was that they were butterflies on the top and then the rest of it was different mixed up. Um, I've ordered some of these little squirt, squirt fairs, no, felt squares. Now, a lot of people don't like this stiff felt, but I do. Um, because it is incredibly useful if you're making brooches, any you know anything that you want to have a little bit of stiffness behind it. And they work really well for... Um, couching onto and stuff like that so they are only um, six by six but that's fine I knew that they weren't expensive and I, do, I can't remember how much they were but um, yeah whole mix of rainbow as you can see but again they are stiffer than normal felt 
uh, which again I like so yeah particularly good if you're doing brooches and stuff like that so that's that um, I seem to remember ordering these but I can't remember what they were I think they were just flower charms again they weren't expensive yeah they're all just different like cactus flowers I bought them to do as um, zip pulls on the bags that I make I thought they'd be quite handy for that let me just shove that out of the way there we are yeah so it's quite a nice mix of doodads there tiny little butterfly there bigger one yeah as I say I bought them to um, oh, I like that cactus well that's cool I like that one uh, yeah because I clip them on with a, a bold pin onto the zipper pull. I just find that's quite a nice little addition. Are you going to go in nicely? No. Hang on. Technical hitch. Cool. I like them. Please with those. Right, I think that's everything I need the black card for. Um, I bought some wooden... Book markers, no, yeah, bookmarks. I don't know. I'm tired, I've been walking dogs all day. Um, I won't be using that for them, but um, yeah, I'm gonna um, try putting my gel prints on them. I thought that'd be quite nice actually. So that'll be a little project coming up. Now, I bought one of the big, is it a six inch? I think it was. No, it's nearly eight, nearly eight inch brayers. And this was only, I don't know, I'm going to have to put it on screen again. Um, but I've seen quite a few people using the big ones. And it said it's for diamond painting, but I'm going to try it on my gel plate. <laughs> I can't see that, you know, there's no marks or anything on it. So, and it feels quite solid because you can get quite a squishy one sometimes for like things like gel um diamond painting but this feels quite solid so we'll give it a go we'll see how that works on the gel plate i bought some crochet hooks i'm going to take up crochet again i have not done it for a very long time and all my crochet hooks i got them out the other day and they're the um clover ones you know the soft grip clovers and all the plastic i guess it is are you going to come out Anyway, the handles, it's gone all squidgy and sort of sticky. It was, it just felt absolutely foul. So, um, yeah, but these weren't expensive. Again, I'll put prices up on the screen. Um, yeah, and they feel quite nice, actually. Yeah, so, some new crochet hooks. Because mine are A, ancient, and B, squidgy and horrible. So, go in. Take those downstairs in a bit. Now, the fabric. Mm. Okay, when you buy them, <laughs> just check your sizes. I could have sworn it said they were fat quarters. These are not fat quarters, but I'm very happy with them. They're a usable size still. So, and what's nice is, I don't know if you can pick up the gold. They are embossed with gold. There, yeah, see in the middle of that flower, you see the gold shining? They're very pretty. So there's that one. It is... It does feel cottony. Whether it'll sh shrink, I I don't know. Um, I'm I'm intending to do sort of journal covers and stuff like that with these, or books, or I don't know. Yeah, probably not anything that's going to be washed. But um, I've got two sets. So obviously, this is the purpley pink set. I can't, as I say, can't remember how much I paid for them to say whether they're good value or not. I don't think they were expensive because you know me, I'm as tight as. <clears throat> That's quite nice. And again, it's got all the metallic print on it. They're very pretty. Which way around the bird goes. I think it's every way. But that's super shiny, that one. Yeah, you see, you really get the, the gold there. So they're pretty. And then the cranes. Again, all the gold. So that was the sort of purpley set. And this is the blue one because I had to get the blue one. And this is 
like little sakura flowers that's nice i like that one actually yeah they're not very big as i say i maybe it's me maybe i didn't read it properly they are eight by eight by ten so yeah nice pretty it's very heavily stalked <laughs> there's lots of that image nice though and again shiny Oh, cool. And then this one, which looks like fireworks to me. Yeah, they don't feel bad. They're not rough or anything. But as I say, I, I, whether they'll shrink and lose colour, I don't know yet. Yeah, that's nice as well. And dragons. <clears throat> Again, with the gold. And again, it doesn't feel that bad. So, there we are. Um, I think that's everything. Uh, that was my first order. I have placed a smaller second one because um, I watched somebody else's haul, like you do. And there was something on there. I thought, oh, I never even thought to search for that. So, um, yeah, it's kind of make a list and then go through it and um, check your sizes check your quantities i knew these were in quantity i think it was six a pack or something yeah it looks like six a pack um but i thought they were bigger i could have sworn it said um fat quarters but obviously not so yeah not bad um i mean this was a 30 pound yeah it was just i think it was just under 30 pound all this lot well these were coming up on amazon at nearly 18 pound so and then I've got all these, you know, and my crochet hooks, and my foot, and my wooden bookmarks, which I can't get in screen. Yeah, and these weird and wonderful things, which will be great if you junk journals. I shall use them. Did I get them for the mushrooms? Maybe. Uh, anyway, that's it. Um, when, the, when the other one comes, I again, I, I need to refresh my memory of what I got. I will do a video for you and yeah i'll try and remember to put all the price on the screen for you all right i just thought i'd show you that quick nosy <laughs> i was watching one yesterday and she had the biggest box in the world arrive and i thought oh my lord but then i found out she was sponsored and i thought ah that's the only way i don't know she probably had a couple of hundred pounds worth of stuff in there so yeah i'm really pleased with this really pleased it's exactly what i wanted nice and stiff perfect Okay, that's it. Thank you very much. <laughs> Bye.